light shining through on a now silent scene. But less than 24 hours ago, this corner on Hilton Street was far from this silent. A shooting taking yet another life on these streets. Today, there's no memorial, no sign that someone was killed here. A 48-year-old man whose name hasn't even been released. He was one of four people killed just this week amid a surge in murders not seen in nearly four years, all taken too soon. Just scratching the surface of a much bigger issue as we hit this tragic milestone of 100 homicides. The shameful thing is that you almost become desensitized. Rod Hudson is a West Baltimore pastor and member of Act Now. I know on this particular corner, we've had at least three murders. He says the constant death seen in our city leaves many people feeling numb. When you've done funeral after funeral after funeral, it touches you in a way like being on a battlefield. It's a battle that's far from being won, but one that Baltimoreans have become too accustomed to. to so many. Violence is a way of life. As more and more faceless victims lose their lives without anyone speaking up.